Welcome back to our YouTube channel. If you are new here, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon to stay updated with our latest content. Today we compare two popular devices, Flipper Zero and HackRF1. Both are gateways to exciting possibilities. Which one is right for you? Let's find out. This essay will guide you through their strengths and weaknesses. We will explore their features and applications. By the end you'll know which device suits your hacking aspirations. The Flipper Zero is a delight. This compact device has quickly become a favorite among tech enthusiasts and security professionals alike. Its small size belies its powerful capabilities, making it an essential tool for anyone interested in exploring the world of digital security and hacking. It's compact, affordable, and surprisingly versatile. You can easily carry it around in your pocket or attach it to your keychain, making it a convenient companion for everyday use. Despite its small size, the Flipper Zero packs a punch with its wide range of functionalities. Imagine a Swiss Army knife for hackers. That's the Flipper Zero. It combines multiple tools into one sleek device, allowing you to perform a variety of tasks without needing a bulky toolkit. Whether you're a seasoned hacker or a curious beginner, the Flipper Zero has something to offer. It fits in your pocket, ready for action. Whenever you need it, just pull it out and start exploring its features. The Flipper Zero is designed to be user-friendly, so you can get started right away without any complicated setup. This device excels in short-range interactions. It's perfect for tasks that require close proximity, such as reading and cloning RFID tags or interacting with NFC devices. The Flipper Zero makes these tasks simple and efficient. It can read RFID tags, clone access cards, and emulate NFC devices. These features make it an invaluable tool for security professionals who need to test and assess the security of various systems. With the Flipper Zero, you can easily identify vulnerabilities and take steps to address them. Need to replay an infrared signal? The Flipper Zero can do that too. It's equipped with an infrared transmitter, allowing you to control a variety of devices, from TVs to air conditioners. This feature adds another layer of versatility to the device. The Flipper Zero can do that too. Whether you're testing the security of infrared-controlled devices or simply want to have some fun with your home electronics, the Flipper Zero has you covered. Its infrared capabilities are just one of the many features that make it a must-have tool. Its simple interface makes it beginner-friendly. The Flipper Zero is designed with ease of use in mind, so even if you're new to the world of hacking and digital security, you can quickly learn how to use it. The intuitive menu system and clear instructions make it accessible to everyone. Don't be fooled by its playful design. The Flipper Zero may look cute with its dolphin logo and colorful interface, but it's a serious tool for serious tasks. Its playful appearance is just a cover for its powerful capabilities. The Flipper Zero is a capable tool. It's used by professionals in the field of security and digital forensics, as well as hobbyists who enjoy exploring the capabilities of modern technology. Its versatility and power make it a valuable addition to any toolkit. It can be used for security assessments and penetration testing. With the Flipper Zero, you can perform a wide range of tests to identify and address security vulnerabilities. It's an essential tool for anyone involved in the field of cybersecurity. However, its limitations lie in its range and computational power. While the Flipper Zero is a powerful tool, it's important to understand its limitations. Its short-range capabilities and limited processing power mean that it's best suited for specific tasks rather than general-purpose use. Nonetheless, within its niche, the Flipper Zero excels and continues to be a favorite among its users. The Hack RF1 is a different beast. Unlike traditional radio devices which are often limited by their hardware, the Hack RF1 is a software-defined radio or SDR. This means that its functionality is determined by software, not hardware. This opens up a world of possibilities for radio enthusiasts, hobbyists, and professionals alike. This is a software-defined radio. With the Hack RF1, you can transmit and receive radio signals across a wide range of frequencies, from 1 MHz to 6 GHz. This makes it incredibly versatile capable of handling everything from AM and FM radio to more complex digital signals. It transmits and receives radio signals over a wide frequency range. Whether you're interested in listening to shortwave radio broadcasts from around the world or experimenting with digital modes like DMR and P25, the Hack RF1 has you covered. Its wide frequency range and powerful software tools make it an essential piece of equipment for anyone serious about radio. Its power lies in its flexibility. You can use it with a variety of software programs, each offering different features and capabilities. 
from simple signal analysis to complex modulation and demodulation tasks, the Hack RF-1 can handle it all. And with its open source nature, the possibilities are virtually endless. Want to analyze GSM signals? The Hack RF-1 can do that. With the right software, you can decode and analyze GSM signals, giving you insights into the world of mobile communications. This can be incredibly useful for security researchers, hobbyists, and anyone interested in understanding how mobile networks operate. How about exploring the world of amateur radio? The Hack RF-1 is perfect for that too. You can use it to listen to and transmit on amateur radio bands, experiment with different modes and frequencies, and even participate in contests and other activities. It's a great way to learn about radio and connect with other enthusiasts. The Hack RF-1 is your tool. Whether you're a beginner just getting started with radio or an experienced operator looking for a powerful and flexible SDR, the Hack RF-1 has something to offer. Its combination of hardware and software capabilities makes it a versatile and valuable addition to any radio enthusiast's toolkit. It allows for complex signal processing and analysis. With the right software you can perform advanced tasks like spectrum analysis, signal decoding and even signal generation. This makes the Hack RF-1 a powerful tool for researchers, engineers and anyone interested in the science of radio. This device is not for the faint of heart. It requires a solid understanding of radio frequency concepts and a willingness to experiment and learn. But for those who are up to the challenge, the rewards can be immense. The Hack RF-1 offers a level of flexibility and capability that is unmatched by most other SDRs on the market. It requires a solid understanding of radio frequency concepts. You'll need to be familiar with things like modulation, demodulation, and signal processing. But don't let that intimidate you. There are plenty of resources available to help you learn, and the Hack RF-1 community is always willing to help out newcomers. It's more expensive than the Flipper Zero. But when you consider the capabilities and flexibility it offers, the price is well worth it. The Hack RF-1 is a professional-grade tool that can handle a wide range of tasks, making it a valuable investment for anyone serious about radio, but its capabilities are far greater. From simple signal analysis to complex signal processing, the Hack RF-1 can do it all. It's a powerful and flexible tool that can open up new possibilities and help you explore the fascinating world of radio. Whether you're a hobbyist, a researcher, or a professional, the Hack RF-1 is a device that can take your radio experiments to the next level. Let's put these devices head to head. The Flipper Zero shines in its user friendliness. It's intuitive and requires minimal setup. The Hack RF-1, while powerful, demands technical proficiency. The Flipper Zero is limited by its predefined functions. The Hack RF-1, on the other hand, is an open book. Its capabilities are limited only by your knowledge and creativity. Section 5. Which device aligns with your hacking ambitions? Choosing the right device really depends on your goals. Are you a beginner interested in access control and RFID? The Flipper Zero is a great starting point. It provides an accessible entry point into the world of hardware hacking. Are you an experienced hacker seeking to delve into RF analysis and signal manipulation? The Hack RF-1 offers unparalleled flexibility. It allows you to explore the radio frequency landscape in depth. Section 6. Responsible hacking a necessity, not an option. A word of caution is necessary. Knowledge is power, but it comes with responsibility. Use these devices ethically and legally. Unauthorized access or interception of data is a crime. Always obtain permission before testing security systems. Remember, ethical hacking benefits everyone. Section 7. Beyond Flipper Zero and Hack RF-1, Expanding Your Horizons The world of hacking hardware extends beyond these two devices. The Proxmark 3 is another popular choice for RFID analysis and manipulation. For software-defined radio enthusiasts, the RTL-SDR offers a budget-friendly alternative to the Hack RF-1. Each device has its strengths and weaknesses. Research and explore to find the tools that fit your needs. Section 8. The future of hacking innovation knows no bounds. The field of hacking hardware is constantly evolving. New devices and technologies emerge regularly. The Flipper Zero and Hack RF-1 are just the tip of the iceberg. As technology advances, so too will the tools at our disposal. The future of hacking is exciting and full of possibilities. Stay curious, stay informed, and never stop exploring. Section 9. Conclusion. Embark on your hacking journey. The Flipper Zero and Hack RF. 
One, offer unique pathways into the world of hardware hacking. These devices are not just tools, they are gateways to a deeper understanding of the digital and physical worlds. With the Flipper Zero you can explore the hidden frequencies and signals that surround us every day. It's a versatile device that fits in your pocket, making it perfect for on-the-go hacking and learning. The Flipper Zero is your pocket-sized companion for everyday exploration. Imagine being able to interact with various electronic devices from key fobs to access cards, all with a single, compact tool. It's designed to be user-friendly, so even if you're new to hardware hacking, you'll find it accessible and engaging. Plus, its open-source nature means you can customize and expand its capabilities as you grow more confident in your skills. The Hack RF1 is a powerful tool for advanced research and experimentation. This device is for those who want to dive deeper into the world of radio frequencies and wireless communication. With the Hack RF1, you can analyze, transmit, and receive signals across a wide range of frequencies. It's a favorite among professionals and hobbyists alike for its versatility and robustness. The choice is yours. Assess your skills, define your goals, and choose the device that aligns with your hacking aspirations. Whether you're just starting out or looking to expand your expertise, it's important to have a clear understanding of what you want to achieve. Write down your goals, make a checklist of the skills you want to acquire, and track your progress. This will help you stay focused and motivated on your hacking journey. Embrace the challenge, learn from your experiences, and never stop pushing the boundaries of what's possible. The world of hardware hacking is vast and ever-evolving, offering endless opportunities for discovery and innovation. As you embark on this journey, remember that every failure is a learning opportunity and every success is a step forward. Stay curious, stay determined, and most importantly, enjoy the process of exploration and